Hello YouTube, welcome to a discussion about fitness. One thing that you may have seen on my Twitch stream is me doing push-ups and burpees and things like that. And I was given a challenge about 88 days ago by a friend of mine who said, you should try doing 100 burpees per day for 20 days. And I thought, that sounds kind of obnoxious. Sure, I'll do it. I'll see if I can do it. It's pretty hard. The first several days were quite hard. Day six, my shoulder hurt. Day 13, my forearm hurt. It was just, ugh. But by day 17, I could just do it. I was doing the 100 per day, and at the end of it, I was like, yeah, feeling good. When I would start the next day, I wasn't sore. My body was able to adapt to it. So the thing that I would recommend for people to consider for themselves is what is your exercise floor? Not the floor that you're jumping on or whatever, but what is the bare minimum physical exertion that you get per day, per week? Because for a lot of people, it's zero. And for me, I'll be honest, many days it could be zero. If no one redeemed push-ups, if I wasn't like in a mood to go do stuff, if I wasn't in the mood to go for a run, I could have a full 24-hour cycle where I went from bed to sitting in my stream chair to bed taking very few steps, whatever the steps that it took to like go to the kitchen and back and go to the bathroom and stuff, which is not really a healthy level of exertion. We can do a lot more than that. And a big part of people feeling upset and anxious and not fulfilled is they don't take themselves out for a walk. They don't figure out, hey, have I been able to get myself some stimulation, some exertion, physically speaking, so that I can feel more relaxed and at ease mentally. The mind and the body are fully connected. It's all one system that's you. So just figuring out how to engage yourself somewhat and get your body moving. The recommendation that was given to me by this friend who uh, recommended the burpee challenge, shout out Avid, appreciate you dude, is it doesn't matter what exercise routine you're doing, whether it's CrossFit, whether it's marathon running, whether it's going for a 10 minute walk once a day, whether it's a Zumba class, who gives a shit? It doesn't matter. All that matters is that you're having fun and that your body is moving. Those are the two things. You'll get lots of people who get in chat, they're like, lifting is the best. If you really want to be fit, you should lift. And then someone else, no, swimming is the best. It gets very petty and childish. Who gives a fuck? Do whatever works for you. If you're a swimmer, heck and swim. If you're a cyclist, heck and cycle. If you can't do this, then don't do that. Do something that works for you. I will show you now a set of burpees. Behold, this is my push-up camera. I'm gonna do some right now for you. And this is my choice exercise now. It engages the upper body when I go down and do the push-up and then I do a squat into a jump. Not all of it is in frame, but you get the idea. And that's just a set. I'll do 10 of those a day. If I do 10 sets of 10, that's 100. Sometimes I'll do a set of 20, sometimes I'll do a set of 30, and I've done one set of 40, which is very hard. But this has been amazing, because every day my floor of what I will do is at 100 burpees. So there's no day, even on my day off stream, where I'm not doing anything. I'm always doing 100 burpees minimum. Maybe I do 110, maybe I do 200, maybe I do burpees plus a run, but it's always at least that. So for yourself, where are you fitness wise? Can you do five push ups at a time? Then do five every day. And then you'll get a lot stronger over time because your body will acclimate, it will adjust. If it realizes, hey, We've been using these muscle symptoms or uh, systems. 
whenever you're doing your exercises, it tears up the tissue a little bit because it's being used, it's straining. And when the body realizes that, it repairs it, invests more energy into it, and it grows back stronger. So you, you do your exercise, muscle tissue is getting all torn up. It's like, oh, we're taking damage. And then you get rest. And while you're resting, your body's like, patch this up here, make this stronger here, put this here, this here. And then you wake up, you're stronger than you were before. So I challenge you, think of something that you could do every day. Maybe it's a 10 minute walk. Maybe it's 10 push-ups. Maybe it's knee push-ups if you can't do regular push-ups. Push-ups and squats. Think of what works for you and then try to keep to that. I'll show you something real quick. This is a notepad and I put down my burpees as little X's because an X represents 10. And that gives me satisfaction every time I do a set. I do a set, I'm tired, I used energy, I get to put a little X down. And it's like giving myself a gold star, like, yeah, that was 10. And then sometimes when I finish all 100 for the day, I'll take a line and I'll just go right through those 100 because I did it. And it feels good to let yourself know, I did that, yeah. So try that. Think of your exercise floor, the bare minimum of, of what you could do every day, and then write it down. Write it down when you do stuff. Give yourself some credit. Be proud of yourself, even if it's small, even if it's three push-ups and three squats, and that's all you did the whole day, but it's more than zero of what you would have been doing otherwise. Try it. You may say I'm crazy being a burpees cultist doing 100 a day, but fitness helps your physical body and it helps your mental game. Help you stay chill. I can manage tilt and anger a lot more easily when I know that I've done a big workout that day because I feel like my body is gaining and I'm growing even if I lost in the ladder, even if it wasn't the most successful stream of all time. If I did my 100 burpees, I am putting my body to the test and getting stronger every day. So get stronger, do something. If you have an idea in the comments of an exercise routine that you could keep up every day, something that you could try, or what you already do, let me know. Because we can all stand to be more fit and strong. Mm.